cotton acres in Louisiana have reached historical lows in recent years, and it seems the decline may not be over. We're probably looking at a further reduction in overall cotton acres in Louisiana. Acreage was expected to pick up this year, but dry weather is keeping some farmers from planting. Cruz estimates that acreage could fall below 200,000. Last year, Louisiana farmers planted around 225,000 acres, but in the past 10 years, Louisiana has seen cotton acreage as high as 800,000. Farmers in North Louisiana were able to plant, but about a third of the intended acres, mainly in the southern part of Louisiana's cotton belt, haven't been planted, and the window for planting cotton is closing. Some growers may face a more difficult choice of do they plant past the optimal window. Um, some will choose to do so and some will probably switch to a crop such as soybeans. Planting too late can lead to yield and quality reduction and more problems with insects and diseases. The dry weather is slowing down the crop that has been planted. Cruz says a stressed crop is vulnerable to pest problems. But the cotton plants haven't quite reached that point yet. Cotton uh, is, is pretty tough when it comes to drought resistance compared to some other crops. And uh, certainly if we can start um, getting some timely rains and break this drought pattern that we're in, uh, things can turn around in a hurry. One positive point for cotton growers is price. A pound of cotton is around 70 to 80 cents, up from last year when it was around 55 to 60 cents. With the LSUAC Center, this is Toby Blanchard reporting.